Hello, I'm Alan Murray. I'm a professor in the School of Engineering and I'm talking about a project called IMPACT. The project was suggested by Ian Kunkler five years ago. Ian is an oncologist who specializes in breast cancer. He told me that now there's a machine called a cyber knife which can hit a volume of tumor the size of a pea with great accuracy. However, we don't currently know where to hit the tumor and when. We don't have that information. So radiotherapy is delivered on a regular schedule to a much larger volume of tissue than is necessary. What we aim to do is to place sensor chips inside the tumour in order to measure where it's most vulnerable and hit it most hard. Here's a chip which is a conventional silicon chip, it's really quite large, and the one in the small plastic package is a prototype sensor chip. It's working but it's still too large and one thing we must do is make that smaller. The chips will be inserted using a needle, rather like the one which is used to put a chip into a cat, and it will tell us when the tumour is at its most vulnerable. In effect, the tumour will tell us when to hit it best to do the most damage. As a result, radiotherapy should be more effective, the overall doses should be smaller, and the damage to healthy tissue should be minimized. However, the implication is that tumor will be hit at its own inconvenience, in other words, not on a regular schedule. This has implications for NHS practice. In, that, in light of all of that, however, the, the aim is to save lives. We're very lucky to have 5.2 million pounds of government money to try to do just that.